Welcome back to another little bit of Lisp. This time we're going to be looking at Rotate F. Now Rotate F is a cool little thing that allows us to swap the values that are in two different places. So let's have a look at this little code example here. So you can see that in this function we're creating two variables, A and B here. A is going to contain one, B is going to contain two, and then we're going to print them out just to show like the order and show that where they are where we expect them to be. And we're going to draw this little line here just as a separator. And then we're going to rotate A and B, and then we're going to pr print them again. So let's see what happens if we compile and run this. So let's do test zero. And you can see that we get one and two, which is what we'd expect. We printed A from one, B, two, then our little line. And now we can see that when we print A, it's got two in it. And when we print B, it's got one in it. And we have rotated those two things. If you've ever written code, which goes something along the, 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 um, the lines of, uh, we take A and we put it in temp, and then we put B in A, and then we put temp in B. That's rotation, but it's just annoying to do normally, and rotate F makes it nicer. And you can stick any number of variables in here. So this could be any number of variables, rather places is more accurate. Um, and to, re to really show that point that we're working with places and not just variables here, let's put in a different test function I have handy. Let's have a look at this one here. Um, Now in test one, um, we've got A which is going to contain one and B is a vector containing these three keywords, this keyword A, keyword B, keyword C. We print those two things out to see what we expect. So let's actually do this here. Comment this out, test one, and we can see that A is indeed one and B is indeed this vector with A and B and C inside it. That's great, right. So let's bring this back in. We're going to rotate A with the value at the first index of the vector B. So this one here, we're saying we're going to swap with A. So see here, we're referring to a place, not a, just a value. And here A is being traded as a place as well. So if we run test one again, we can see that before we had one and we had ABC in our vector, and now we have B and A1C in our vector. So this is important. This is not just um, rotating variables. This is rotating arbitrary places. So things provided by AREF and ELT and get hash and things like this are all places. We're gonna probably do another episode on generalized references and I'll cover more of that there. But for now, that's enough for us. See you in another little bit of Lisp.